Good evening, fellow Groove Riders. Will from Wheels Electrical Services, also known as the Midfield General. If you could do us a massive favour before I start the video, if you could like, subscribe and turn the notification bell on, it helps support the channel. In tonight's episode, what I want to do is, uh, I unfortunately had to buy this today. This is the Mega VF5, and this is a non-contact voltage detector, or volt stick, volt pen, or whatever you want to call it. I did have this older one, and uh, I've got this older one, which I reviewed in another episode, and I, I reviewed all the other ones. I buy a lot of these. I have got a lot of apprentices and a lot of people, and because they go in my snicker pocket and all that, obviously when they're at home, they, I take them out of my pockets and leave them at home. So at home here, they're scattered around everywhere. So I've probably got about a 10 in total. I know it's ridiculous, isn't it? But it, it is what it is. But one thing I did not like about this one, which was different to all the others, which I've come to use to. On the first time I, I reviewed these, I did actually say that I didn't like it because it was pretty big. But with these snicker, fli like slim, slim fit trousers, they're perfect. Because I always usually, traditionally now, carry around a torch. And I like this torch. I have no doubt I'll bore you in the future about it. Enough a plane going over. Cheers, guys. Yeah, is that I like this one because they just feel like a security guard. Do you know what I mean? You're just going in places and just people are like, oh, well, check him out. He's dangerous. But then I... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> then I found this one over, uh, like in one of my uh, old test bags because I've, we've got enough a fella new started. I bought this meter, so I had to juggle around all the meters and all that. And I found this one in the bag. And obviously, this is the start of November, so about three weeks ago, the old clocks went uh, forward or back, whichever way round it is. So it's obviously darker a lot earlier. And this is just absolutely perfect. What I'll do in a minute is I'll turn the lights off and I'll just show you what it's like just with the torches, you know, well, it's pretty pointless, so I ain't gonna bother with that, because like, it's, you know, they are what they are, but they do light up quite well, you know what I mean? I might put an image on, on the screen, because else it'd just be a bit too tragic, me standing in the dark. But others that, like these, this is the VF2, this is the VF5, I think it is. Grant and Stone Stevenage, where I bought it today, and Steve told me, because I looked online as well, and they, they're like, on my Amazon, I don't know what Amazon's playing there about at the moment, I think I'm probably buying too much, because all the prices are too much, because Simon, Simon or Luke, or it might have been Bristol Sparky, he put up a tripod for a, for a, uh, for a laser and i think he was for a score but when i followed the link it was like 35 quid so i was like sod that you know at 20 quid i was gonna have it but for not for 35 but this at this they like steve reckons is 15 quid plus vat or thereabouts so if you say a score but this is awesome compared to this one this one just like lights up lights up you've got no switch on it so it's a bonus but this one, you've got two switches. You've got, a, you've got a 12 volt. I've only just got it out, so I'm not too familiar with it, but it's got a light, but it turns to orange. But for some reason, it don't, I don't know if that makes it more sensitive if you're looking at LED strip, but it works on any as well. And apparently, if you turn it on, it's got the green light. It, it's five minutes until it goes on standby, and that's the same with the torch, and you've got to turn, the, it's a different switch for the button. What I have noticed, what I did mention in the past, which this one has got as well, it's got the buttons where it go in your pocket, but you've actually, you, 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 you've actually forcefully got to turn it on. I don't think you could just turn it on just by it stroking in your pocket. It might do when it gets older and all that, but I tell you, it's a nice bit of kit, and I'll just quickly show you, because I'm pretty sure you've all got the fluke, the fluke one as well. Scooby-Doo moment, I'll come back for the, with that. Yeah, so this is the flute one, and look, you can see the size, you know, it's absolutely brilliant. As I say, I know there's a lot of people who don't like these, especially commercial electricians. I know when our first 10 years of doing like uh, all this, we I used to do it like with all containment and all that. So these are pretty pointless because obviously it doesn't work. It works off EMF, so it won't work on like Galv Conjurer, armoured cable, FP, any cable that's screened or put, like mechanically protected it won't work on. But obviously it'll work on high tough, it'll probably work on on uh, all singles and twin and earth, you know. So in a domestic market and stuff like that, it's, it's, 
it's absolutely perfect. I think for non-contact, you can't use it for uh, to prove dead, but you know, it, it is what it is. It, each one of them's got a uh, warning on it, you know, test on known live circuits before each use. You know, this one goes down to 12 volts to, uh, to 12, 12 volts up to a thousand. I think they, I think they all do, or this one's a hundred volts. And this one, I think this one goes down to 12 volts because I tried it earlier. But one thing about it is, it is a bit exciting, it vibrates as well. But as I say about proving safe and all that, and I know a lot of people get up, uh, you know, as they should do, but what I've got here is the Breast Practice Guide 2, Guidance for Management and Electrical Safety and Safe Isolation Procedures for Low Voltage Installations. I'll attach this to the bottom so you can have a little ganders at it, but quite clearly none of this is gonna be in there, but I just thought I'd, I just thought I'd mention it just in case anyone gets a bit too excited about it, because these proper jazz people up. But this is a stunning pen, and if you get that for under a score, then it is what you call round my way a right touch. Thanks for watching, just a little episode, and don't forget, if you're gonna be anything today, then be electric. Up the old village, you know. <laughs> See you later.